I'd like to uh, review the uh, COVID numbers for the last week. So as of today, uh, we now have uh, 2,369 positive tests. That's up 683 from the numbers last week. Right now we have 295 active uh, cases and that's up 103 from last week. We now have 1,547 people who have recovered and that's up 69 from the previous numbers. Uh, we have 11 uh, people in the hospital versus 13 last week. And unfortunately we had three more deaths this week. We're up to 19 deaths versus the 16 from last week. And we have 40,917 uh, negative tests registered, and that's up 4,029 uh, from last week's numbers. Wisconsin has been identified as a COVID-19 hotspot in the United States. Sheboygan County has contributed to the outbreak of these new cases. Some of our uptick in the cases has been caused by the outbreak at the Kettle Moraine Correctional Facility, where roughly one third of their inmate population has tested positive for COVID-19. There continues to be isolated uh, positive cases reported at some of the Sheboygan schools. Uh, the ones that are affected are the Sheboygan Central High School, Sheboygan North High School, Sheboygan South High School, Lutheran High School, and then some elementary schools, Grant, Longfellow, and Sheridan Elementary Schools. At this time, the schools continue to mix school days with virtual learning and in-place learning. Sheboygan County Safe Restart Plan, uh, we are currently in phase two and we remain there, but uh, we have a lot of uh, negative markers right now and are on the brink of falling back into phase one. Sheboygan County school risk level uh, is currently at the high risk level and Governor Evers uh, recently continued the mask order through the uh, late November. It was welcome to see many of our commercial businesses taking action to require masks while shoppers conduct business in their fa facilities. It's good to see that they recognize the role that this can play to help protect the health and well-being of the community that they serve by following the evolving guidance of our health officials. Remember to wear a mask and slow the spread of coronavirus in Sheboygan. Join the Mask Up campaign. Thank you.